All right, we're just gonna go over the basics of boxing, your basic footwork and your basic punches and punch techniques, just a little cues and things you need to think about. So first, to your stance. If you're, we're gonna assume that you're right-handed. So if you're right-handed, your left leg is forward, your right leg is back. Your right leg is forward and to the left, your back leg is back and to the right a little bit. You're on the balls of your feet, your heels are elevated off the floor. So you should be able to slide a credit card underneath your heels. You have a little bounce, a little flow, a little rhythm in your, in your step. Your hands are up, not at your chin. Don't think chin, think at your cheekbones. This is what hands up. Elbows shouldn't be framed out like an A, it should be in tight, little tilt forward in your waist. So you can see from the side here, I have a little tilt forward, my chin is tucked, my hands are up at my cheekbones, elbows in tight to protect the ribs. So first for the footwork, if I'm moving forward, the direction I'm moving in, I wanna move that foot first. So I'm starting here, I'm never gonna get closer together in this basic stance. So if I'm moving forward, I'm gonna move this front foot first. I'm just gonna walk it out first to show you. Step, back to my original stance. Step, back to my original stance. Backwards, I would use my back foot, my right foot first. Back, original stance. So I'm stepping wide, back to my stance. Wide, back to my stance. To go to the left, I would move my left foot first. So I'm gonna step wide to the left and back only to my stance. So I'm not letting my feet crisscross. I'm never getting my feet closer together front to back or side to side than this basic stance. So to the left, my left foot would go first. To the right, my right foot would go first. No matter how fast I'm moving, no matter how fast I'm moving, I'm always maintaining that stance. This is your basic stance and footwork. Let's just go right into your basic punches. Your one, your one is your straight left, your left jab. One is your straight left. Light on your feet, bounce in your step, turn into it. From a side view, see it's straight out and it's behind my shoulder, bam. Whatever hand is not punching from a closer view, you can see is glued to my face, protecting my face. Let's hit it a couple times on the bag just so you can see it in action. Boom. Breathe out for each one. It snaps it out, return right back to home, to your guard. So you're snapping out, look at my fist. Palm starts facing in, ends up facing the ground, get a little shoulder snap into it, and back right into the guard. Two, two is your straight left. You can see my feet. I'm gonna pivot my right foot, turning this right hip. Same thing, palm starts facing in, I'm leaning towards the target, shifting the weight into this right side. So one foot stays solid, one foot's gonna pivot. My two, a little closer so you can see the palms facing in. Whipping this right hip. Whatever hand's not punching stays up at the chin. Let's throw it a couple times on the back. So you're lighting your feet, little flow, little rhythm. Left hand stays up. Pivoting that right foot, turning right into it. Your three is your left hook. Your left hook is coming from the side. So those ones and twos, we're in a straight line. Your threes and fours, your hooks, are moving parallel to the floor. Think of this hook being 90 degrees, moving parallel to the floor. Your body is throwing the punch. You're pivoting that side you're throwing on. This other hand stays home. Left hook is your three. Right hand stays up at the chin. Pivot and turn. And our four, our right hook. Pivoting this right foot now. Elbow up and out, a little closer. There's our three, left hook. Four, right hook. So we're not cocking it back way here. It's just right from here. Side and bam. There's your three and your four. Three, four. Let's get some on the bag here. So those straights, I was further away from the bag to hit those straight punches. The hooks, I'm gonna be a little closer, mid-range. So I can hit the side of the bag. Think about hitting the jaw, the temple, the ear. The ribs, that's where you're aiming with these. Three, four is your right hook. Pivoting the feet, shifting your weight. Little bounce, little flow, you can flow into it. Elbow up and out, there's your threes and your fours. Your five and your six are uppercuts. They're now moving straight up and down, perpendicular to the floor. So the ones and twos, we're straights right here. Threes and fours. This plane parallel to the floor. Now fives and sixes straight up and down. Uppercut, your five is a crunch. Boom, think about coming right underneath the chin or right into the gut. Five is your left uppercut. Little twist, little crunch of the waist, the obliques. And a six, your right uppercut. Palm again, starts facing in. It's a little dip, turn it up. Driving up, powered by the hips and legs. All these punches, the, the power comes from the ground up. The movement is in the legs and hips. The arm is just going along for the ride. So there's our five, our left uppercut. And our six, crunch. Right uppercut. Keeping the chin tucked, the hands up. Trials on the back. So we're gonna be even closer to the bag this time. Straight some way out here. 
Hooks is kind of mid to close range. Uppercuts are even closer. So just on our five. If you had a bat, if you had to hang over a chin, it'd be a little different. You would drive straight up on a, on a heavy bag. You're going to be digging it in, not really getting as much follow through. Five. Crunch. Six is your right arm. So our straights were our ones and twos. Our hooks were our three and four. Our five and six were the uppercuts. The odd numbers were on the left hand. One, three, and five. Even numbers on the right. Two, four, six. Don't forget, you're pivoting the feet on those punches. The only one you're really not pivoting on is the, is the first one, the one, the jab. But that one, you should be still snapping, leaning into that forward foot. And again, the two. Pivot that right foot. Turn. The three. Pivot the left foot. Turn. Four. The right hook. Pivot the right foot. Five. Crunch. Boom. A little turn. Not pivoting as much, but driving up with the legs in the five. And six. Twist. Crunch. Shifting that weight into that side. So that's your basic footwork and your six basic punches. No excuses.